Uh, hello, uh, folks. This is Gabriel De La Vega Jr., CEO of TVKnowsYou.com. Uh, today, I have some news for you that's just going to blow your socks off, truthfully. I just thought I would never in my life have to tell you what I'm going to tell you right now. When it comes to your... Um, when it comes to your cell phone, like uh, your Apple phone, your any smartphone that you may have that has a camera on the front end and on the back end, um, well, folks, this is not good news. Really, this is not good news at all. You might as well just trash that $1,000 iPhone, that $2,000 Samsung. Just trash it because it's no good. When I say it's no good, it's because your privacy is gone. Uh, that guy that uh, snitched on the government, whatever his name was, and he ran off to Russia. I don't know what his name was, but he was on to something. He was trying to warn us. And uh, I just stumbled upon something today, I would say about an hour ago. And I already made a donation link for this because it's that serious. Uh, but the point is, I ran across this software called uh, Spy 366, whatever it may be. I have photos all over this recording in this video. And on these guys, they're selling the software where they can get into your phone and watch you live on the front camera, on the back camera, without you knowing it. Uh, they also can do various other things. I'll go through that in, in the photos that I put up here. And um, they can read your email. Or they, they can see what web pages you're on. They can hear you. They can take snapshots. They can see everything you do on your iPhone screen, which, you know, this is bad. They can also uh, watch you live, drive down the freeway on a map so they know exactly where you're at and it just the list goes on and on the features they have is just it's just there's a lot of features this software has and but the the thing where i come into the picture is i'm the guy that has a patent on live streaming mobile video so they got this thing set up to the point where you can actually uh they're actually uh mimicking my uh uh my original invention where you can you know, put the camera on the dash and just watch the car in front of you and and you know if you want to turn the camera around they can take a picture of you and look at you and you and you, and you can sit there and talk and and be the spokesperson for this live video that you're aware of it's going on where you have an on and off button where you can control this but what these guys are doing and they claim it's legal Things through, I guess they say it's legal. It's not legal till it gets by me, because uh, I have the patents on live stream mobile video, and uh, yeah, they are uh, definitely infringe on my patents for one. Uh, how severe? Well, that's 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 for the courts to decide. Uh, but the point is, what I'm getting at is, they can stream. And go into this dark web and get, you know, a bunch of viewers together, and, you know, this dark web and pay a, a fee and just select which people they want to see as entertainment and sell this, you know, off, you know, off the, the radar there underground uh, in the dark web and sell this and take my invention on in the dark web versus just breaking it public and we all make money and everything's transparent. Now these guys, these guys are serious business in terms of just blatantly stealing my stuff and in a, in a gray area of trying to make it legal and not legal. But, you know, uh, they claim that this is for to watch their children and so forth. But the thing is, I had a little conversation with them through their app there. You know, to watch your school kids and control them and for your employer to watch you. But even so, I mean, your employer has no right to get into your phone. And they say, well, only if the employer owns a phone. But at the same time, they want like three, four hundred dollars. I don't know what their price was or two hundred dollars to go ahead 
and just give you a, a phone number, a target phone number. Takes five hours, and boom, you have you have a dashboard with all these features on it where they can access your phone and just control everything. And you don't even, and they can just you know, and he, it looks like you know, I was allowed to do is give them a phone number, and boom, I, I'm in business. The point is, even though the point is they're doing it, and somehow they got it, you know. In the in the gray area of oh if you have children this is allowed or if you have if you're an employer you're allowed to watch your employee but your employee doesn't have to know and your children don't have to know so this is you know this can go beyond that this invades our privacy just the fact that they can do it and they got the software running and you know they're charging you know over a hundred dollars to get the software they're making lots of money and it is. Um, they claim it's legal. I said, who says it's legal? In which country is it legal? You know, oh, well, you, and then once I've said, is it, is it infringing on my patents? And then they say, oh, you have to call our legal department. That's where I'm at now. So I'm going to get some money together and uh, I'm going to fight for you, the people of the world, because right now we have no privacy whatsoever with these cell phones. And, and, and these can be used in terrorist attacks like that, uh, that, uh, that attack that was done in Israel. I mean, is all the, those kids at the party is all they had to do is buy this software, get their phone numbers, or get at least a few of their phone numbers and know where they're at, and that's it. They go in there and boom, 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 boom. They take out everybody. So this can be used for terrorist activities. This can be used for the government activities to just completely keep us in a cage. And they know everything you're doing. They know who you're talking to. Oh, they can also listen to your calls, to your phone calls. They can also see your text messages. And from what I understand, yeah, if they can, they can see your screen, of course they're going to see your emails. So, everything you do on your phone, everything you have on your screen, they can see with this software. And this has been going on for quite a while, from what I understand. And, uh, and, and we're starting to see the repercussions of it with these terrorists, this last terrorist attack where uh, our intelligence had no idea that they were going to attack Israel. And I can foresee them using this tool to know what our people are doing, the people that are supposed to be watching them. So, and everybody, all the politicians that have a cell phone, they're vulnerable to this. Everybody has a cell phone is vulnerable to this. That's why I say just throw your phone out the window and just run it over with a car or something and, and take it, put it in a million pieces and go back to just the landline in your house. I mean, it'd be much safer. Uh, but at this point, we're into this so deep that everybody isn't going to just voluntarily give up their cell phone, including me. I mean, I'm attached to this damn thing. So, um, yeah, we need to go to the court and we need to, you know, put regulations on this. And the only one that's in position to do anything about this until the year 2027 is me. I set up that link. You can donate five dollars a dollar, or you can land it. You can donate whatever you want. Just keep pushing the plus button, and uh, it, you know, you can add up the money there and give me whatever you want. Uh, if you want to make a really big, big donation, we'll certainly uh, call me up. Uh, but it won't be private. Everything that I say on this phone from now on is going to be watched by these guys that own the software. But um, you can email me at CEO at TVNosy.com if I catch that. But uh, we are in a bad, bad, bad situation, folks. I mean, this is like time for Jesus to show up and just take us all into heaven because I don't see any good outcome coming from this when... Uh, when we have zero privacy, I mean zero. I mean they they know if you're eating breakfast, they know if you're eating Cheerios, they know uh, you know if you're making love to your wife. They hear every word. They can eavesdrop into your life. Not only they they can just verb uh, you know v hear you verbally speaking. They know what you're thinking by uh, looking at you. Uh, get on your phone. They, every website you visit, they they've been there with you. They're like they're right. They're like they're like the Holy Spirit next to you watching your only move, but they don't have the power of the Holy Spirit. But please donate for humanity. And if you're a tough guy and you want to fight back, donate. That's all I got to say, folks. This is real. This is scary. And we've overlooked this. And now it's time to take action through my patents that are still valid. So donate right away. Talk to you later.